This is Patrick, the owner of Geocron. Let's take a look at my favorite three things about the earthquake layer. First of all, who knew there were so many earthquakes around the world every day? On a map, it creates quite a clutter. And that's my first favorite thing, the ability to fade out earthquakes that have occurred in the past, but still identify swarms of seismic activity over time. All earthquakes time out after five days on the Geocron. My second favorite thing? Our database is updated every 15 minutes, and since the Geocron calls home about every 30 seconds for new data, you'll stay right on top of what's shaken around the world. The map is updated as well as the log, which you can turn on and off. And number three, size and color changes with the size of the event. In North America, where we get data down to one magnitude and force, you'll see lots of little tremors, including in the Midwest. That's not a plate or a volcano, that's actually fracking. Elsewhere, we pass data that is 4.0 or larger. The circles get bigger and darker, allowing us to put more information in them. And if you see a red circle, well, let's hope that's not where a lot of people live. When you start throwing in all the layers you want to see, things can get really busy. I'll show you. We'll start with a topographical map set in grayscale and add uh, China Eastern Airlines over here. There's the earthquake layer. Let's throw in the submarine cables and weather satellites. And finally, weather. Whoa, that's busy, but it is a busy world. This is a premium layer with a trial period available on our Atlas or version 2 platforms. We provide many layers at no charge, like those shown here. We're not ad-supported, so unless you want to see Google Ads scrolling on the Geocron, we do charge a small amount for some specific layers to cover our costs to get it to you. It's easy to subscribe to a premium layer through our website, geocron.com. Then go enjoy all of Earth in real time in 4K.